more than 900 Californians. A Roseville nurse reached out to us tonight with concerns that our region's health care facilities are not prepared. Turns out she learned this firsthand during her own test for the coronavirus. Our Giacomo Luca joins us live outside the Sutter Roseville Medical Center where this nurse says she had an eye-opening experience. Giacomo. Well, that's right, Ananda. That healthcare worker spoke with us under the condition of anonymity. She says she was tested at Sutter Roseville Hospital. That's right behind us. She says that whole experience in an isolation tent waiting hours here has her concern that state officials aren't prepared. We've been warned that a day like this was coming. We've been warned that there might be some novel virus or some pathogen that comes out and and it spreads like this. And I think that we had a, a little bit of naivety. A registered nurse who works in the Sacramento area is opening up tonight about her experience being tested for coronavirus in Roseville. She tells us she started feeling sick a week ago. And then my fever got really, really high on Wednesday. And I was just extremely tired, um, very short of breath, coughing, just coughing, coughing, coughing. So out of an abundance of caution, she requested to be tested for the coronavirus and was directed to Sutter Roseville Hospital. She described the testing center. It was um, a tent um, in a um, area that was pretty heavy with foot traffic, pretty heavy with vehicle traffic. She described that outdoor isolation tent she spent five hours in. She says it lacked proper biohazard storage and hand sanitizing stations. She also says health care workers weren't wearing proper protective gear. As a nurse, I would have been really uncomfortable. She's bringing this to our attention because she's concerned what will happen if large scale testing is needed. I, I, I don't see how we're going to avoid making the outbreak much worse. Now that nurse tells us both she and her teenage daughter had coronavirus symptoms. They've been tested for the virus and they are waiting to get those results. Now we did reach out to Sutter Roseville for a response on what this healthcare worker had to say. They tell us, quote, our teams are trained and equipped to provide high quality care. Sutter Roseville erected a tent in order to prepare for a potential surge in patients and to screen respiratory illnesses away from the general population. We encourage patients without life threatening symptoms to utilize options like video visits or nurse advice lines prior to visiting the emergency room. Giacomo, we got to see inside one of those tents. Does she mention anything about being cold? Yeah, so she said this tent, which is outside, it wasn't heated. She also mentioned a couple of other things about just the overall comfort for patients that go into those tents to be tested. She says there were only four hard chairs, not a normal doctor's table with a cushioned seat on it, as well as the overall cleanliness inside the tent just didn't appear well. Ananda. All right. Thank you so much, Giacomo. And today, the Elk Grove Unified School District announced they're closing all of their schools and canceling all.